This video is now brought to you by GeekWithTree.com Hello oh, what's up people, Dobsterwoods is right here and welcome to another Pokemon pack opening. Before we start, please check out GeekWithTree.com Now, this is something different people. Now, just like you guys know, this is not from GeekWithTree, this is from Costco. This is the Costco Pokeball and Tin Collection right here. Now, this is pretty much two products in one big shebang, which is cool to be honest. Now, <clears throat> I have a, a fellow duelist in Geek Retreat who was talking to me, who also collects Pokemon like I do, and he said to me that he has never seen these before because he bought these in a random shop in Berry. Now, I had to tell him truthfully on that the person that he bought them off scanned him big time because he bought them for 20 I think he said 20 to 22 pound for these I paid 17 pound with tax from Costco and I bet that's what the guy did so he pretty much was buying them to sell them on for even more stupid prices and I like I said people you guys already know that I bought a whole lot of these and I still got a lot of them sealed away because they will get opened up on the channel so there you go so I here we got ourselves a luxury ball what code is it it's D21, okay, and then of course you get yourself the Vaporeon GX box, which is lovely. Let's go ahead and crack these two open, and let's see what we can get out of them. Use myself my little letter opener off camera, as you guys know. Say no to knives. And this one is going to be the most biggest pain in the ass, because it's that stupid cellophane. The, uh, it loves wrapping like a flipping disco ball. Ah, come on. I love it when they do this to me, these Pokemon products. There we go. So, right here. So, I don't remember what is in this Pokeball. Let's see what we can get. So, we get ourselves a Sword and Shield, Bl Darkness Ablaze, and a Rebel Clash. That's really good. And what's the coin? An Entei coin. We'll put that to the side. We'll put the ball elsewhere. Let's have a look at the tin. So, of course, you get yourself the beautiful Vaporeon GX, which I'm sure you get the price right there. Cha-ching. <laughs> leave that up really quick. There's your code. And it's gone. And you get yourself four other packs. We're going to go ahead and close this tin away and put it to the side. Away. There we go. So you get yourself a Vivid Voltage, Battle Styles, Darkness of Blaze, and a Rubber Clash again. So that's not bad. We've got a good amount of selection right here. Uh, we're going to keep the Burnt Darkness of Blaze last because we all still want to hunt down for that Charizard. Vivid Voltage still for the Rainbow. Uh, rubber Clash there, Battle Styles, and then Sword and Shield. Okay. Let's start with the base set Sword and Shield. Let's see what we can get out of these. Come on, let's try and get ourselves some good hollows out of this Costco tin box. Now, like I said, though, people, these are from Costco, so they're very unlikely you might pull something absolutely amazing, but sometimes it can happen. And that's happened to me before. Baltoy, a Vulpix, and a Chinchio. Okay, first pack and nothing in Sword and Shield. What about Battle Styles? Sadly, the set that a lot, a lot of people do not like. To be honest, I really do like Battle Styles. I think it's a fun, fun, very fun um, pack to open up. And of course, Ushifu, Mr. Miyagi, pretty much pulled the best cards out of there, except for the, I think it's alternate artwork ones. I'm not 100% sure. But I have pulled the Rainbow Rares of both the Mr. Miyagi's. So I do not mind getting them again, which would be amazing. We got Super. And we get some quicker tune. <laughs> Great, that's awesome. We actually haven't got Quick Tune, so that's good to know. We'll definitely sleeve that up right there and then. Nice, we've got ourselves Quick Tune. A Quick Tune V. <laughs> I can't complain there. And like I said, a lot, a lot of people do love Quick Tune a lot. I think they like him more than Bidoof, if I recall. But like I said, Bidoof is a god among Pokemon. <laughs> Next pack, this is Rebel Clash. Can we get more Joe Strummer cards? As you guys know, Toxtricity, he's one of my favourite Pokemon, Mr. Joe Strummer himself. We got ourselves a Psychic Energy, Scoop Up Net, Chatot, Charger Bug, Natu, how do you do? Honage, that's a massive shout out to Leon Hart, love you Leon Hart, you're awesome mate. We got Electabuzz, a Palosand, 
and a Surfetch Hollow. That's actually not bad either. Okay. This is actually looking really well. And was that a reverse foil rare that I just saw then? Was that a reverse foil rare? It is not. It's uncommon. Okay. That's quite a surprise that Pile of Sand is a uncommon. It used to be a rare quite a few times. Final pack of Rebel Clash. Can we hit big again? Let's hope we can. One, two, three, four. Let's have a looky. We got Lightning Energy, Heracross, Electrode, Beware the Beware, Litwick, Lotad, Clefairy, Voltorb, Growlithe. We got ourselves a Reverse World Pokeball and a Weezing Hollow. I tell you what though, people, this is looking really promising. We're getting hollows. This is good. Now, a lot of people may be thinking, Dobsy, that is trash. You need yourself the GXs. The V Maxes, the this amazing full art, the rainbows. You need them to make your money back. Hey, I don't care about money. You guys care about the money. That's why I do the editing. But for me, all I care about is having new cards that I don't own, so I can collect them. If they're some I've already got, yeah, I will sell them on. <clears throat> we got ourselves. Um, this was a Darkness Ablaze pack, so let's hope we get a Charizard. We got Fighting Energy. Dusclops, Rocky Helmet, a Galvarantor, it's an electric spider, Charmander, Char! Chatot, Joltik, Cockney, Mudbury, a reverse foil rare Metagross. Oh, very nice, we got ourselves the Colossal V. I thought it was Charizard then, but like I said, it is it's not textured, so that was not going to be our win. But either way, nice, we got ourselves a Colossal V and a reverse foil rare. We'll move them to the side. There we go. This is looking really promising, people. We pulled ourselves two V cards out of these two tins, not inc not including the um, promo that we get. So this is really, really good, people. Uh, da Darkness Ablaze. Oh, that was Vivid Voltage. My mistake. Okay, Darkness Ablaze now. Where is it? Yeah. Yeah, it was, that was Vivid Voltage. My mistake. Right. We didn't get the fat Pikachu, so we still have a chance to get ourselves the Charizard, Gothita, Piers, Powerful Energy, Chuck Cub Chew, Wormpud, Bunnelby, Toxel, Cinnati, a reverse foil, is that a rare? No it isn't, it's a Toxipex and a Gramble. Okay, final pack of Destiny, can we get ourselves that Charizard or anything else that's amazing from Darts of Blaze? Darts of Blaze at the moment in time though people, they have really have been literally not releasing a lot of it like i said though people they are out of print the only thing you got left now are the ones that are in the factory just literally stacking up into tins and the only way you can get them now is to get them from little tins like these or maybe if you're lucky get a boost box of it but like i said the boost box is going for stupid money we got spinner act and a beer tick ah wompy wompy womp never mind either way though i'm very happy on what we pulled to be honest, my luck is still there. Before we say goodbye, let's see what we pulled today for reverse fours. We've got Spinarak, Toxapex, Pokeball, a Palo Sand, Sporpa, Volt, a Vulpix. Then for reverse four rare, we got ourselves the Metagross. And then for Hollow Rares of the day, to be honest, people, are ah, really, really good. We got ourselves the Weezing Galarian, a Galarian Surfetched, a Cricketune V. A Colossal V and a Vaporeon GX. If you guys enjoyed it, I surely did. Make sure you smash the like button as always. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. And with that being said, the people I'm assuming you guys subscribing and check out geekretreat.com. Cheerio! Not bad from Costco to be honest. I thought I was going to get absolutely nothing. There's always a positive every single day for me. I like getting these, these are nice. I don't have a clue what the volumes are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah! Ah!